The 30 meter telescope, as its name says, is a telescope which is 30 meter in diameter. Uh, that's the diameter of the primary mirror. Uh, that's not the only mirror. Uh, there will be a secondary mirror and a tertiary mirror. We are going to have a suite of instruments on these telescopes uh, that are going to be uh, sitting on uh, uh, what we call platform on each side of the telescope. And the light will be reflected from the tertiary mirror. Sometimes in order to answer big questions like uh, uh, how was the universe formed, uh, what it is made of, um, uh, trying to understand our place in the universe ourselves, okay, are we alone? Uh, are there uh, other, like, um, I would say, life, okay, extraterrestrial life in other exoplanets uh, somewhere in our galaxy and the universe at large? Uh, you need to make big steps for that, okay? And I would, I would say that this uh, uh, telescope, the TMT, will enable such a big state in terms of uh, advancements of uh, the, our understanding of the universe. You want a telescope to be sitting on the best place possible, obviously, because that's going to be an expensive telescope, very powerful. You want a high mountain, you want a place where you have clear sky. And you also, there is a, a, a third parameter which is very important, that's uh, the quality of the atmosphere itself. A place like Mauna Kea, for instance, combines the three. Okay, so you have a high percentage of clear night, it's quite high, and at the same time, the quality of the atmosphere is superb.